will double nuts, triple nuts, or a few variations withstand my DIY impact and vibration test. I already know that a single nut on a bolt sandwiching two flange bushings and torque to a low and unfavorable 6 foot pounds consistently loosened in under 15 seconds. Let's experiment. The following results are for these specific tests and conditions. First, double nuts. Torque to 6 foot pounds and 6 foot pounds. And the results were the same as a single nut. Next, triple nuts. Torque to 6 foot pounds, 6 foot pounds, and 6 foot pounds. And the results, again, were the same as a single nut. All three nuts were loose. I then tried a coupling nut that is about three and a half times the height of a single nut. Torque to the same unfavorable six foot pound. Failed again within 15 seconds. I hoped for a better result and tried again, which resulted in the same result. How about double nuts torqued to 6 foot pounds and 10 foot pounds? After 15 seconds, no movement. After 30 seconds, no movement. After one minute, still no movement. And in just under two minutes, the top nut flew off. That deserved another test. And the second result was a surprising 15 second failure. Next, triple nuts torqued to 6 foot pounds and 10 foot pounds and 10 foot pounds. After 30 seconds, no movement. And just under one minute, all three nuts flew off. That deserved another test. After 30 seconds, no movement. After two minutes, no movement. And after five minutes, no movement. That called for a third test. After one minute, no movement. And after five minutes, again, no movement. Two out of three, not bad. But a still quite low 10 foot pounds of torque on a single nut. Consistently held tight for 10 minutes. And is one reason why I use a low and more entertaining six foot pounds in my tests. Keep an eye out for my thread locker and Nord lock tests.